So I got some mail. First up, we got some stuff from CHC. I mean, a couple, whatever you want to call them. And uh, what happened was, I think it was Carson Hines and someone else, I forget who, uh, donated a box for certain roles, and I happened to be win. Yeah, so it's uh, from Karsten Hunt Silver and Byron the Collector, I believe. So, and then, per usual, a Quinnan sticker. And then, I got the roll pulls as well. Oops, they knock them out. And Karsten Hunt the Collector, I think it was like 10 rolls. I knocked a couple out already. But I uh, got a couple of NFCs, a 2009 and a 2018. See if we get the camera to focus. There we go. So I got some NFCs. Just gonna put them over in a pile. Got a V nickel, nineteen or nine V nickel. Pretty neat. Don't have a bunch of those. Got a Indian head penny. I need to get a folder for these. It's eighteen ninety. Don't see a mint mark. So, but still Indian head penny. Pretty neat. And we got a. B51 San Francisco Rosie Dime, so pretty awesome there, silver dime. And then I got, it's a, I believe this is a one ouncer. Uh, I'm not sure what this one is. I think it is one ounce. So it is Eastern Caribbean Central Bank. One ounce fine silver, so pretty awesome there. I'm gonna go and put. All this back in the baggie, actually, just so I don't lose it for right now. I'm just set it all out to the side because I got some stuff from Kimmy Gunn's family. So big, but it's from Boston Baked Beans. Okay, so a giant envelope that I can get on the screen. So there's a couple wrap. Mats, and I got some books as well. Uh, Strike It Rich, and Pocket Change. Uh, and got a note. I'm just gonna. I just read it off camera. Uh, just because kind of a little more stuff I don't want to show on camera. And I got. Uh, there's a couple other things. I got everything out. But if you can't guess just from seeing that, it's roll mats. He had it in a literally tied up with a ribbon. I don't know why I thought oh, I said these are bigger on camera, but we got maybe some Rob uh, Hunt's uh, Rob Fine Treasure, whatever, uh, Lincoln Penny Mat, and a Clad Cornish Varieties Mat. It's a pretty cool. I was, for some reason, I always thought these things were bigger <laughs> just based off of Rob's videos. And then I got a 20 red book, forgot to show that. Then he sent a few coins as well. So first up, uh, 69 Denver uh, Lincoln cent. Oh, it's 1943 Denver. I don't think I have that one. He's not, definitely not in that shape. Another 69 D and a 1956 D. So definitely really awesome. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. Oh wait, uh, that's from the mail. But uh, while I was on vacation, I went to a couple coin stores. I didn't get these at the coin store, but I just kind of thought the bills were neat. I kind of like old cars, so that one's definitely neat. I'm also a fan of old TV shows and things, so the Munsters, really awesome there. And while they went to a coin show, not coin, coin store, picked up a mini uh, Lincoln set, set uh, still sent, just for comparison, normal size penny, so that's probably about the size of a dime. So, I got, and I did actually, for all these, I think it was like $29 for all four of these coins, three cent nickel, 1865, don't have any of those, so definitely thought it was neat. I don't have any of these large cents either, so. Not in the, I mean, it's not in awful, awful shape. It's not the best. But I don't have one, so definitely neat. And the seated dime, something else I didn't have, unfortunately. 
that. I didn't catch it. I just saw the front. Thought it was cool. Grabbed it. But, uh, you know, I've seen some cool stuff. I want to say thanks to Carson Hunt Silver and Byron the Collector for the win from CHC. Boston Baked Beans for the books, coins, and mats. And that's it, guys. Remember, uh, like, share, subscribe. See you all in the next one.